Hey everyone, Mr. Fantastic here. We are back with episode 7 of our Icky Claw campaign, which definitely could be going better. Um, not gonna lie. Definitely could be going better. Uh, is he in Magrita proper? Yeah, he is. Okay. Uh, let's get him out of Force March now. Okay, awesome. Uh, we're gonna end the turn. I'm really not sure. Like, Icky Claw, we're gonna be able to pound up uh, his whenever we need to with Regiments of Renown. It's total army size. Like, obviously, some of these are pretty expensive, but we'll see what we can do. I'm so nervous. Oh, he left. He left. Thank God. I'm just an Averlorn. Like, I don't know what to do. I think we need to have three armies go over to Althuan and just wreck it, right? Just sack our way through. Sack raids, sack raids, sack raids. We might even just start actually taking some of them, too. Uh, he's going to declare war? No. Um, I think we're going to take the non-aggression now. There's just no point in not... We're not going to be able to get over there, right? My technocracy. Very nervous right now, to be honest. We need more money coming in. It's way more money coming in to be able to do much of anything. Uh, that's one turn away. We need to get that upgraded next turn. We need that research. So let's uh, cancel that and just end the turn. Basically, we'll get Ickbolt. Oh, we're at war with them. Let's get out of the way. Because we're way out of his range now. I would prefer to do that fight. Um, actually, I should have done that fight. I should have just turned around and fought him. That would have been a decent amount of cash coming in. And I don't think this is an army we'd have to worry about, to be honest. The Iron Drakes are a little bit, but we got so much more range on them. And these guys can take out their artillery. Yeah, we could have definitely won that. Um... Sorcery. Death. I don't know where we're going. I don't know what we're doing. I'm very nervous. This will grow, like, eventually. Like, we're max food right now. We're pretty close to. Um, yeah, because what we're going is trying to do this plan within plans, which is this, right? And that's a... Uh, this one. The Pox Cauldron. And that is what we're upgrading, right? Yeah. Yeah. On the turn, keep an eye on... They're going towards Bali right now, which is not I'm ideal. Like it. It's a 20 stack. Uh, let's force march our butts into Bali. And let's do a, now, now. a couple regiments for now and upgrade them in there. I think with the walls, though... I think with the walls, we're completely fine. More Warpstone. Okay, regiments for now... I want this, and I want this. Okay. So because of that, we might not be able to do the upgrade next turn, and our income did drop. The four chief warlock. Oh, what are you gonna declare war? Shocking. But I think we do have the income to support another army. We'll check for the here too. Oh, they're really coming. Okay, so he was taking attrition just a second ago, though. So maybe before oh, that's both armies. Dead. This is not a strong army. Maybe what we could do. Enemies to track. What we could do is sort of Kane's fine right here. Um, recruit those three and go take him out before he's an issue. Kill, slay, yeah, Pyrrhic victory. I think we'll be able to do better than a Pyrrhic victory here. Um, get five of those. Let's see what this looks like. It doesn't kill anybody. But we have another army coming, so we have to do better. Like, we have. Oh, this is stressful. Like, we're going to get a lot of money out of this. Like, they're just going to send wave after wave after wave against us. Uh, maybe we can just grind them out and peace out with them slowly. It's just going to slow us down a lot. Like, this is going to be a completely new focus for us, which is not really what I was looking forward to. Um, I do like this ridge, though. Uh, let's go ahead and put these guys onto the right a little bit. Yeah, they don't get hidden, which is unfortunate, but that's fine. Uh, we're going to put these guys kind of over here, ready to charge in. 
The Jezails here are going to be really useful because they're the only ones with the right amount of range. Let's do this. And then we'll do this. Are the Jezails in the middle? No, of course not. Why would they be in the middle? Why did you switch them there? I just don't understand why it moves in the ground weirdly sometimes. Okay. I don't really like that, but we're going to have to deal with it. Uh, we're going to basically move these guys forward a touch. So let's put these guys here. More. Oh, what the? What the heck? Put them there. It get claw. You're going to have to get up there quick. Uh, you're going to go back here. Uh, I think that's okay. Oh! What the, what the? That's so frustrating. Get those guys back. Uh, this might actually be better for it. This first. Right there. a little bit. Decent amount of damage still. Not excited about that. He needs to back off. Use that really quick. You can use your Doom Rocket. That would have actually been a really good spot for a uh, full rocket. Maybe even put that down there. See if we can get a real rocket in. Doing okay right now. I'm hoping that we do some damage here. Really separated now. Where is it? Claw. Well, it's taking damage. That's fine. Their infantry isn't the issue. Do you mean their infantry is just not the issue? Get these guys in a better position. Oh, wrong. Okay, so let's go ahead and use this there. Just to get rid of them. Make it claw. Use that. Use this. We do. Yeah, we're doing just fine right now. We're chilling. Um. Come on, we gotta take more of these guys out. Take it, Claw. We gotta take out more of these archers, right? Like these little things, Sea Guard. There, we just need to die. Those are the issues, right? I doubt they'll be able to catch them. What is their speed? Oh, yeah. Yeah, they're not gonna be able to catch him. That's fine. I don't really need to. Oh, it could claw. Why are you not talking that?
Catch him. Take it, Claw. I need you to take him out. Stop them from moving, please. Get the claw attack on me. They're gonna get away. Triple speed it. Get some more in there, please. Not quite. Okay. Hopefully, Ica Claw finish them off. They're gone. They're gone. Okay. So, yeah, that wasn't that bad. Like, we barely took any real damage there. Uh, mostly, Ica Claw did the work like usual. Uh, but then again, our catapults always do a lot of really good work as well. So, I don't know if these are any good, to be honest. Do not know. I like that they come fully ranked, though. That's really nice. Get those extra boosts. Um, these guys are pretty good. I don't expect them to get a lot of kills. Like, I expect Ick Claw to be doing most of the work. 171. I'm hoping that maybe the army... Maybe even if it's not completely wiped out, as long as it's close, it'd be really, really ideal. Uh, I don't know if we're going to peace out with Kothik anytime soon, though. Okay, decisive victory. Let's get a... Lunch take replenishment. 1275 is too much to pass up right now. So that's not them completely wiped out. But it's close. Okay, let's wipe them out so they don't come back. This army is like really nothing. We'll take the 5% there. And then we're going to force march with him to Bali, Bali again. Or at least relatively close. Okay. Speak your poisoned word and be gone. Strength turn three. That's not ideal. Uh, what about you, Kothik? What are you doing? Protocol now? insists I receive your plea, no. but don't. Okay. You can get into Magrita. No and probably out of Force March? Nah. Because you're not in Magrita proper for some reason. That was weird. Okay. Uh, Scave and Blight. You have a bunch of upgrades we can do, or we can start building another army. I think right now we don't need to build that army. I think right now what we need to do is just focus on getting upgrades done. This is 10 grand almost. Okay, well, we need it. Skaven so we're going to not spend our money this turn. Anywhere. Wound, please. Unassigned skill points for the Warlock Engineer. Oh, didn't we just get... We had two for him. Okay. Uh, if it claw, probably has a couple levels. Ancient Cunning is good. I want to get over the Lightning struck, Strike and then Renowned and Feared. Quartermaster, all that good stuff. Uh, yeah, we're not spending our money. Okay. Let's see what they do. Let's see what they're planning. I'm assuming Kothi turns around. Ah, they turned around too, okay. Um, we need to be building up another army, like, really quick. We have all this food that we're just not using, which is unfortunate. But there's not much we can do about it, right? Like, there's not... Where are my schematics? Science. Yeah, I'm pretty sure can hold its own as soon as we get this done. But we need the money right now, so. It still cannot upgrade this just yet. And what does this give me? Why is that so expensive? Faction wide recruit rank. For a lord. And hero recruit rank plus two. That's pretty good. That's pretty good stuff. Uh, this, what is this gonna be? 2 5? Technology, which is cool. Food generated, income from all buildings is 5, and ingenious plans. Ingenious plan. Volatile plants and plants. Where is it? Oh, do we already have a tier 5 one of those? Where is ingenious plants? I don't know. But I want this. Because then it gets to this, which is super good. <laughs> Um, okay. I don't know where Ingenious Plants is. Okay. 
I only see two locked, oppressive and volatile. Whatever. Yeah. Do we have a tier five one of those somewhere? Vermintide. Tier four. That'd be a good one to get because that would be a lot of extra income coming from here. 3,200 from there and 2,655. Yeah, this is definitely our money making province, but I could just go ahead and do that. Which gives me another 10% income across the board, and there's still a lot more to upgrade here, too, right? So, this is going to be Estalia's where we make our money for sure. Um, this guy isn't that bad to fight. I fought him before. Uh, okay, we're going to wait till next turn, and then we're going to start making another arm flow. We're going to have to wait two turns, I guess. They could try and take Sartosa. I just don't see that happening. No, I will not it's too far away. Let's yeah, see what they do. He's still just like wandering around. <laughs> Getting frustrated. Getting bogged down to a ridiculous degree, right? This guy we might even be able to reach now, though. No, he left. He's like, nope. A whole lot of nope there. Uh, the Knights of Regio are still alive, weirdly enough. I have no idea where they are. Oh, they're going there. I am a lord of Britonia. I am a lord Never. of Britonia. Get some details. I will 14 not units. My soul. I think we should be able to beat this. Mirigliano. Okay. That's five turns. We're done our research in six. So that's perfect. Uh, and then what we can do is start building another army. have anything really all that good though okay i'm gonna be right back you guys will notice a quick cut okay sorry about that um i'm not really sure which one i want to go with like this one i'm gonna go with a, a warlord a strategist uh a strategist and we're gonna go recruit regiments for now nope we're good uh do, 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 do. just looking oh i need to recruit a couple heroes into this army if possible Sorcerer, we don't really have anything good at all. Um, campaign movement range, please. Put him in there. Uh, another hero would be great. We want disciplined. And we'll end the turn. Unassigned skill points for Ickbolt himself. Still pretty close to that, but not quite. Crack's call. We're gonna need it. Chosen. I'm kind of thinking Exo we should just so pop out here and attack, get the money in. Pure victory, eh? I don't believe that. At all, actually. Like, that's definitely not a pure victory to me at all. I the auto resolve with Skaven. Like I think high elves are the best in auto resolve, but with Skaven, they're just so bad. It just feels like no matter what we do, like what army composition you have, you're just gonna lose. They're scaven too, homie. Um, don't really like this map very much, but that's fine. Um, move everybody just out of the way for a sec. Okay. Just want to see what's going on a little bit better. Move you guys, well there except for why are you on the edge <sighs> there we go they're in the middle now somehow okay anyways uh let's move up a little bit there okay let's get these guys out to the side maybe just have these two out to the side right about there do they have vanguard they do not do you have vanguard no i don't know no i need them all together because i have a hard time microwing already having another one to deal with in a different area it's probably not going to go very well for me okay uh let's do this and see how it lines them up or they can tell it's wrong okay now they're both on the side oh no we're good we're good we're good okay and let's move these guys just here for now be able to pull them where we need them and these guys kind of same thing uh you can just chill there it could claw you can move forward off the hop uh start battle let's move you guys up move you up 
We need the money, right? Kinda want this here, to be honest. Although this might be better. Right there. Uh no. Doing damage, which is good. Uh, let's use this. Oh, a bunch of them just appeared. That's good. That was kind of a waste of that ability. I'm just trying to get like a good spell in right now. Not happening. Uh, yeah, let's make sure this plague flaw is still attacking that guy. Make sure this plague flaw is still attacking that guy. Let's get this guy to attack this guy here. Or actually, let's get this guy to attack this guy here. Let's make sure they're all on guard mode. Uh, let's just take out the clan rats there. I think that'll be fine. Okay. Should have cast that before I cast the other one. That's fine. Use the Doom Rocket. Warfire Throwers. Make sure we're using this there. This there. Okay. These guys attack them. But you attack them. Oh. Back up. Guard mode. Guard mode. Right about there. Should be a good one. Okay. Why are you guys so far forward? Clan Rats. Plague monks, where are you? Where is this guy? He's fighting somebody that doesn't matter. Oh, oopsie daisy. That's fine. Those rattling guns might get destroyed here. Okay, make it claw. Scorch them. Especially on like stuff like that. Um, but I think we're okay no matter what here. Um yeah, I think we'll be okay. Take as many as we can. Uh, we might be able to get another battle out of this one. We got rid of a lot of their important units. Like, some of them survived. Like, these guys survived. I might get one of these. They only got three kills each, so he got... A, like, it was these guys. Most of their melee infantry that got kills. Um, we did okay. Expected these guys to get more kills, though. I think we were focusing more on our monstrous units, though, with these guys, right? We are focusing on their big guys. That makes sense. Hopefully we can get an auto-resolve in here without losing these guys. It'd be really, really ideal. No 
Um, we need the money. As much as I want replenishment, yes, we need money right now. We're poor. Slice of victory. That's why we did it. It's for money, right? We did all of this for money. Okay. Getting as close as possible. Into Vivaldi. Possible. Get one point in looter, I guess. Okay. You are gonna get the income. You now that we have money in for hero. Um get one of them for now. And we'll start recruiting stuff that we actually want. Rattling guns would be really, really nice. We want two of those. Let's get rid of one of those. Either way, it's going to be four turns. It doesn't really matter. Um, Get some plague monks in there. It's a lot of income just there, right? Okay. I might get some rat ogres in there as well. We definitely want more of these guys, though, so let's cancel those and let's get uh, three more of those guys. Get. It's going to be very, very expensive. Uh, build another Doom die. Rocket. <laughs> this army is worth four grand, right? Like, we can't afford an army worth four grand, and this army is worth five. Like, we can't afford that right now. But what we can afford, the Fae Enchant is for not a war with. The Loria, you're at 16. But yeah, what we can afford is to have maybe a half stack just kind of patrolling here. But we send these two armies to go and attack. I think that'll be the best case scenario. If we just park this guy right there. And with what he has, that should be enough. Maybe just fill him out with some slaves now. Maybe just spears. Oh, yeah, the knights are coming. Oh, Grimgore did finally do that. Hey, Lucini is actually where you're headed. I think Lucini can still take him on. And he's taking attrition. Not very much, but he's taking attrition. I think we'll still be able to beat him. But if we need to, we can pop like a lord or something in there. Okay, anyways. Um, leave these guys while we're recruiting. Those guys can stay out. This guy can get in. Let's recruit another hero if we can. We'll go with magic item drop chance, I guess. It's kind of expensive having the heroes there, but it is what it is. Uh, let's just go Skaven, uh, Skaven Slave Slingers for the rest. There we go. 18 of 20, and then that's... Oh, so it's getting 19 of 20 there. Or 17 of 20, because that'll be three more units in there. It's going to be very expensive to have all this. It is. Like, it's going to be very, very expensive. Um, we can leave Magrita now. Uh, you can get out of Force March, though. Oh. Okay. So the plan is to be working our way towards here soon. So let's bring you out. I think Ickbolt can handle a single army by himself. Won't be able to handle too much more than that, but we're going to send them both. Still a few turns away until we can even do this, though. It's four turns away, so maybe we're moving too early. I think that's probably the case. Uh, I was not ready for this. What you want, homie? I'll take non-aggression. Maybe even trade with you if you want it. I wonder how Camry feels about us... But on it's like having war with piles there. I can't imagine he cares either way. Do not invoke the gods around Setra. Just great power he likes. They bow to me. I ascend. No, no. Um. Okay. 
fine. We are going up. It's good. Ickbolt, you have this no guy got a level. Uh, we're just going tail weapon with you now, hey? Oh, immortality. First. Needs errands um, to prove his go work. survivalist with you right away. Although, we're going to need the missile resistance right away. Okay. Just get Ickbolt to be chilling. Kind of there. That's fine. You guys are just boosting my income a little bit. So we only have 500 income, so we're not going to be able to afford that. At all. Um, we'll take that. And that'll be it. That'll be our force that we leave out here. Like, luckily we have the play claws, we have the rattling guns, we have some priests and some engineers, so we should be okay. Um, overall, I... Are they Do you actually take me on my mind? They're at 12 and 20 my now. Uh, they are sieging me. Close victory. Just auto resolve that. I don't know if we'll get another fight out of it. I don't think fight. we need one. Let's just get money. Good, good, good. We're done. That's fine. Gives us a little bit of a war chest, more or less, which is really nice. Uh, did we end the turn, or did we just get this? I think we just got this with them. Do not invoke no, the dead. Okay. Listen to me, me. Naked Claw, you got a level. Perfect. We have Draft Master, which is Nas. Okay. You watch this so our Tosa is ready to level, but like all of it, like, we have 500 gold in them. So we are going to probably go over here. We're probably going to try and take their capital um, and get that to a tier 5 immediately. Sack it. Tier 5. Done. And then we can kind of just chill. In a couple. Like we have one turn until we can start moving him over. So I think we'll be okay. We didn't check for trade with them. But trade agreement, that is so handy right now. Like 500 gold isn't a ton. But it's just so handy. Do you know what I mean? Helps us so much. Oh, that's really useful as well. Techless is coming to Magrita. Good luck with that, buddy. Uh, we're going to go ahead and force march our butts over there, though. Uh, what we're going to do, actually, is we're going to put him between a rock and a hard place here. Uh, you guys can come join. Okay. Okay, we have eight grand. We're doing okay. Uh, can you actually reach Magrita? You can. Sailing from Magrita doesn't really—it doesn't really matter which one we sail from, right? I would love to get that island, but like right now is not the time. Good luck, buddy. Okay. End the turn. Let's see what Teclas does. Came out of flank speed. And that's it. He just chilled there. That's awesome. So we're going to bring Ica Claw in. We're going to crush Teclas here. Get some money in. Maybe do some upgrades to increase our income a little bit. And then we're going to move this guy here. And then we're going to move on. And take on Lothurn. I think, yeah, we'll start a really good base there at tier 5. Uh, we will not... Take attrition. Take up their offer though. You're not really doing too well on that front, which sucks, but maybe we can get this battle in, maybe that'll help him. Stalk. Yes, yes. I don't know where he's gonna be able to escape to. Oh, uh, I went too far away. I am warlock! Not enough warp stone. <laughs> Unnatural. It's gonna auto resolve this one. Close victory? Are you kidding? Wait, actually? This is actually a joke. Casualties are low, though. I guess we'll. We have to fight it. We have to fight it. How is this a close victory? Maybe Teclis himself? I just don't understand. 
just don't get it. So I know this is a super weird cliffhanger -y place to end the episode, but honestly, we're way over we're over time by a decent margin, and I would like to make sure that we can get one more episode recorded today. If I go too much farther over time, I will not be able to do that. So this is the end of episode seven. Thank you very much for joining me, guys. I really do appreciate it. We'll be back with episode eight right away here.